Tinder date goes awry when woman sets man his SUV on fire at Kendall Hotel. Ah, it's a love story, kids. Are you kidding me? This has everything. It has Tinder. It has Miami. That's where people go to find their soulmates, you know. And it has a Holiday Inn Express. The only thing that's missing is a carriage and a pair of glass slippers. A Tinder date didn't go as planned. Gee, what tipped you off for a man after a 25-year-old woman lit him and his car on fire at a Kendall Hotel, Miami-Dade police said. Destiny Lene Johnson was charged with armed aggravated battery with bodily harm, attempted felony murder, and first-degree arson after she was arrested late last month. She remained behind bars Thursday at Miami-Dade County's Turner Guilford Knight Correctional Center after a judge denied her bail on one of the charges jail records show. Check her out. Isn't she the sweetest? Just look at those nurturing eyes. You have to give her a second date. I mean, lines were crossed. I'll give you that, but that's nothing a little communication can't handle. The Miami-Dade Public Defender's Office didn't immediately respond to the Miami Herald's email request for comment. Johnson pleaded not guilty Tuesday, and a judge ordered her to stay away from the man and the hotel. See, that's why I have to disagree with you, Judge. How are you going to keep those two apart around 6 a.m.? November 25th, the man told police he was waiting for Johnson, who he had met during a Tinder date about a week earlier at Holiday Inn Express and Suites 11520 North Kendall Drive when he noticed something off about her, according to her arrest report. I don't do victim shaming. That's not my ministry, but it's Tinder, dude. You should have knew she was going to come with some missing parts, some assembly required, some batteries not included, something. The man saw Johnson walk from a vehicle in a neighborhood parking lot to his car carrying what appeared to be a one gallon water jug she then opened his suv's passenger door but did not get in instead the man told police she said she needed money to fix her car after the man gave johnson the 60 dollars he had on him he said her demeanor changed rapidly yelling you guys are out to get me she then poured a yellow liquid that smelled like gasoline from the jug onto the front passenger seat of his vehicle the man told police let's be honest with each other most people on Tinder do not care about giving you money to get your car fixed. They're trying to smash. Whatever you do with the money afterwards, that's on you. But nine times out of ten, they're looking for some sort of sexual interaction. The fact that he gave her the money that he did have on him is pretty solid because he could have easily just rolled off. The man tried to push the jug out of his SUV, causing additional ignitable fluid, damn, to spill inside his vehicle and on himself, he told police. Johnson, he said, ignited the fluid with the lighter setting fire to the interior of his car his right arm and herself she is insane the man said he got out of the car and rolled on the asphalt to extinguish the flames burning his body soon after his suv was in flames quick thinking stop drop and roll according to the man he then took out his firearm because he was scared that Johnson was going to try to set him on fire again. She then ran away, allowing him to go to the front desk at the hotel and ask for help. Miami-Dade Fire Rescue took him to HCA Florida Kendall Hospital. The easy assumption would be drugs, but I'm not going to make the easy assumption because I don't know. Oddly enough, she looks like the very same Destiny Lene Johnson that got charged with aggravated assault back in Arizona, the Florida of the West back in 2020, she might just be a wild girl. Almost two hours after the attack, a 911 call led police to find a naked Johnson saying that she blew up a vehicle. She was taken to the same hospital after claiming she was being sex trafficked, police said. Johnson's next court date is December 18th. How many of you think they just got off to a bad start and they should give it another try?